In a dramatic turn of events, a 22-year-old individual identified as Sujil Amjad has been handed a life sentence for his role in an assassination plot that involved the use of a high-powered submachine gun. The weapon in question, capable of firing 800 rounds per minute, was part of an arsenal Amjad helped distribute to an assailant last December. The plot unfolded when Amjad and accomplices retrieved a cache of weapons from a location in Wolverhampton, which included not only the lethal Scorpion submachine gun, but also several pistols and a shotgun. These were then handed over to the shooter, who targeted a residence in Southbourne Avenue, Hodge Hill. The would-be assassin, masked and armed, initially fired at the house but found his target absent. He lay in wait, and upon the return of his intended victim, unleashed a barrage of bullets towards the car, narrowly missing the occupant. The shooter then escaped in two stolen vehicles, which were subsequently found torched. During the trial at Birmingham Crown Court, evidence including text messages and photos linked Amjad directly to the crime. He was not only involved in supplying the weaponry, but also in arranging cloned number plates for the getaway cars and their subsequent destruction to erase evidence. Detective Inspector Francis Nock highlighted the severity of the weapon used, expressing relief that no one was injured given the firepower involved. The Scorpion is not your average firearm. It's military grade, designed for maximum impact, Nock stated, emphasizing the ongoing hunt for the shooter who has since fled the country. Amjad was convicted on charges of attempted murder and arson, receiving a life sentence with a minimum term of 20 years. The case underscores the dangers of illegal firearms proliferation and the lengths law enforcement will go to dismantle such criminal networks. Despite the capture and sentencing of Amjad, the search for the gunman continues, with authorities vowing to apprehend him.